Hello, darling. Do you have the time, please? It's Beer Monster O'Clock. Hello, guys. Hope you're all doing really well. Got another beer review for you. As always, this one's a Polish one. It's something a bit different. It's the first Polish beer I've reviewed on this channel. So, uh, yeah, something a bit different. It is a lager, I think, or maybe a Pilsner. I'm not too sure, because uh, there's a bit of Polish uh, writing going on there, and uh, I don't know what it means. Um, there's a quick look at the bottle. It's in a nice brand bottle. That's a good start, because a lot of these big boys, it's a 650ml bottle. They normally come in, or well, quite often come in a green bottle, and as you know, you get the skunkiness with that, didn't you? So, uh, yeah. Thumbs up, brown bottle, good start. Uh, this is a Polish lager, as I say, it's 5% ABV. Uh, I picked this up from Tesco Express, around the corner from me. It's in the three for a fiver deal. And I've not tried it before, so I thought, let's give this a go. Let's see uh, what Polish beer is like. Because um, I've really got no idea. Um, so yeah, I thought it'd be interesting to try it. It says it's been going since 1629, so, you know, it must be quite good because um we're still being sold now there you go anyway grab, grab a bottle opener get it open so a little sniff of the rim on the bottle oh it sounds quite malty this one like a citrusy smell Smells good. I want to get in the glass and have another little sniff though, I think. Sticking it in the pills in the glass. I'm not too sure what it is, but um yeah. I don't have a decent lager glass at the minute. Uh well I do, but it's got all writing in that over it, so I'll probably stick it in this. There we go. As you can see, it's uh, got your typical lager look. It's quite a light uh lager light golden color very clear you can see me right through there and my four eyes nice clear looking lager this one uh carbonation wise is pretty well carbonated uh fast moving bubbles yeah there you go probably can't pick it up on the camera uh maybe i need to start doing some reviews during the day so you can pick up more guys uh anyway let's have another little smell now it's in the glass yeah, it does smell very malty, like a barley malt, I think. Bit of lemon, like a citrusy lemon smell. It smells quite good for a lager, I've got to say, guys. So, uh, anyway, cheers, guys. Let's see what it tastes like. Um, I don't know really what to think. Polish lager. There you go. Let's, let's, let's give it a go, though. It's good, surprisingly good. I didn't really have high hopes for this. Not really much info on the bottle. Not in English anyway, but I tell you what, it don't half taste bad, first impressions. Let's go in again and uh, think about the flavors and stuff, but Definitely tastes a lot better than what I thought it was going to do. I'm quite surprised by this. I've seen it for ages. I just sort of never really got around to trying it for some reason. Um, I don't know, Polish ain't really known in the UK for their beer, I suppose. Um, maybe they are. Maybe they do do a good beer because this one certainly tastes all right. Anyway, let's go again. I think I'll dive a bit deeper into it. It's definitely got more taste to it than most of the shitty beers we get over here in the UK. I mean, this is mass produced as well. I see it everywhere in all the supermarkets, corn shops, Tesco Expresses, all that sort of thing. You see this shit everywhere. Don't know why I've never thought to try it. Like I say, I think it's just because it was Polish, I thought it, it thought it would be shit. But 
it's actually decent. It's quite a malty lager. You've got the kind of uh, barley, bready, malty sort of taste to it. Mm. I'm impressed, guys. I am impressed. You've got the citrus in there, lemon. I mean, it's a lager. I am only, well, my review for this is comparing it to other lagers. Same as I review an IPA or a stout, I compare it to only the other beers in the same category. So I'm giving this a review for a lager. And for a lager, it's quite tasty. It's got more flavour than most lagers do. Let's go again. There's something else coming through. It's not quite sure what it is. Um, yeah, it's like caramel. A bit of caramel in here as well. Hmm. Bready, caramelly, a bit of barley in there, citrusy lemon. It's quite a bit going on for a lager here. It's, it's very refreshing as well, as most lagers are. Um, I'm really enjoying this one. I'm really enjoying this. I'm definitely going to pick it up again, guys. Definitely got quite a malty character character to it for a lager. <laughs> Definitely slightly carbonated as well, as you can tell. But um, no, this is I think honestly think this is a decent lager. It's really surprised me. Um, I'm surprised I've not really been told about this before, really. As um, as you know, I started this channel a couple of months ago, and uh, all I used to drink was lager before that. Um, yeah, but I'm reviewing uh, lagers as well, as well as craft beers and everything else, guys. Check out my other videos. There's loads of them. Uh, if you're watching this, uh, check out my other videos, guys. Come on. I'm new to this. I could do a system support. Hit that like button as well while you're at it. And if you're new to the channel, think about subscribing. I'd really appreciate it. It helped me out, especially if you love a bit of beer. I want people to subscribe that love a beer. And uh, we'll keep watching my content. But anyway... To summarise, I am very surprised by this. Uh, for a lager, like I say, I'm only comparing this to other lagers. This is going to get a good, good score for me. I'm going to have one more go because I'm kind of set on what I'm going to give it, but I'm not quite sure. That's a This is a decent lager. It really is. Um, really surprised me actually. I wasn't. I did not have high hopes. I am going to give this for a lager a eight point five out of ten. This is really good. And if I see any more Polish lagers, I'm going to have to give them a try because this has really impressed me. This has uh, really surprised me. I don't know whether I. I could session it or not. I'd have to have a go and find out, wouldn't I? Because, um, yeah, it's quite malty. Sometimes you get a bit tired of the malty lagers. Um, I don't have a wood with this, though, because it's so easy drinking. It's, it's a really, really good lager. If you're a lager drinker, I highly recommend this. Um, give it a go. Let me know what you think. Do you agree with me, or do you think I'm chatting bullshit? Um, I'd love to hear from you guys. Um, yeah, 8.5 out of 10 for me, guys. I've, uh, yeah, that, that's it. 8.5 out of 10 for me. Uh, really surprised me. Take care, guys. See you in the next one, yeah? Bye-bye, darlings.